Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. This is Frances with Sassy Mingo. Um, I'm here today with a Thread Up Mystery Fun Box. Haven't had one of these in a, in a minute. Um, I hope y'all are having a good day. It is Thursday here. Um, I am pre-recording, in case you didn't know. I'm getting ready to have a grandbaby this weekend, so I have to get ahead of the game because hopefully I'm gonna be busy. <laughs> So my first grandbaby and it's a little girl and I am, I am over the moon. I cannot wait. I don't know what her name is. They've kept that a secret from everyone till she's born. So that'll be cute. Try to find out, you know, what her name is. Anyway, um, if you're new here, welcome. If you're, if you've been here before, welcome back. As you know, I'm a full-time reseller on many platforms. I like to do mystery unboxings. I like to take you thrifting. I like to show you thrifted items I've styled in my home. I also do a funny little short little video on Instagram and I load them up on YouTube of thrifting fails, items that I find out in the wild that are just crazy or scary or I would never have in my house and stuff like that. I just try to have a lot of fun. Um, but today we are here with a Thread Up Mystery Fun Box. A fun box is a fun box. You don't know what you're going to get in here. I don't buy these to typically resell to make a profit. However, I have. <laughs> I guess my best, my best item was a pair of sunglasses. And they had a name brand on them. I can't remember what they are now. They ended up selling on eBay for $110. Now, y'all, I pay $34. I think it's $34 for these box, plus shipping, plus tax. So, you know, it comes out to probably close to $50. But one item in that box, I got $110. That was my profit. There was some some name brand hand I sunglasses. They were, you know, they weren't in the original box. They were wrapped up in bubble wrap. Anyway, you never know. You just never know. Usually they're socks, slippers, um, a bra. You just never know. So let's get into it. Okay. This box came from Mechanicsburg, Pennsylvania. I am in South Carolina, and that is where most of my Thread Up boxes come. I think I've gotten two from Phoenix, and I think that's it. Um, oh, no, I've gotten some from Swanee, Georgia. That's right. But the majority come from Pennsylvania. So... Let's see what we got. This is what it looks like before I pull the paper off. Ooh. Sometimes these boxes can be themed. It seems like recently more of my boxes have a theme, like a pink theme, a blue theme, a gray theme, a black theme. So I'm not sure. We may have a blue theme going on. Well, I don't know. Anyway. We're going to dig in and find out. This box is packed, y'all. I don't know if it's just one big item in here that's making it feel that way, but it was very heavy. Um, this is what we have right here on the top. Let's look and see what this is. Oh, this is cute. This is a Guess AirPod case. That's cute. Um, I didn't mention this, but I do sell these items unless I tell you, oh, I'm keeping that or I'm going to give that to my sister. Or, I'm going to give that to my friend or blah, 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 blah. But, um, so these items are for sale. If you're interested, I'll put my email below. I may shoot out a price on some of these things, um, <clears throat> as I go along. Um, and I may not. So if I don't give you a price and you see something that you want to purchase, sorry, y'all, my voice is cracking. It does it every time. If you see something you want to purchase, please email me below. I will have my email in the comments below, the top comment. I'll pin it. And um, it just works. It works easier that way. I invo invoice through PayPal or I take payment through Venmo, whichever one works better for you. 
Um, I do charge shipping, um, and that'll be based on your address and the item that you buy and what it, what it weighs. I try to find the cheapest shipping rate that I can get for you. Um, but anyway, so we have this new in the package. It looks like it may have came from Raw, not Ross, um, TJ Maxx or Marshalls maybe. This is the back. The price is all ripped off, so I don't know. But it's Guess, and it's got a little charm. Can you see the charm? The My ring light is glaring. But anyway, it's a gold, black, sparkly case. That's cute. Um, I'll say $5. $5 for this. I'm going to write this stuff down because I will forget. Guess AirPod. five dollars all righty next right here on top we have some fashion tights a new day these are um what are these called fishnet these are fishnet and these are large extra large they retailed for ten dollars at i'm not oh this is target a new day that's right so we have some fishnet y'all Large, extra large, um, nylon, spandex, fishnet, and I will let these go for $4. $4 if you want the fishnet. With, um, and they're not just for that, but if Halloween coming up, these are, these are great with costumes, fishnet pantyhose. There you have them. There's the size chart on the back. If you need, you know, the measurements for the large, extra large, just shoot me a message and I can help you out with that. All righty, let's see what's in this bag. Oh, what's in this bag? Y'all, this is a coach bag. This is a coach bag. I'm just more excited about the bag. I don't, I don't know what's in it. It looks like it may be a keychain. Oh, it is. It's a coach keychain. It's a, what is this? This is what it looks like, y'all. It's got silver hardware. You've got these um, buttons right here that say coach, and then it says established. No, it says coach, yeah, established 1941. But it, okay. So it snaps and you actually have two keychains. How about that? This is kind of masculine looking. So this I think is on the, the men's side. Um, without me researching or anything, I'm just gonna say $10 for the coach. Um, the coach keychain, it's, it's, it's a two part. That's kind of cool. Um, and y'all, there is nowhere on this whatsoever so as my subscribers ten dollars you're getting a great deal these kind of you know what's so crazy is you know we all are pretty familiar with the coach purses and the wallets and what they go for but sometimes their accessories and their little you know their their little key charms and and things like that they're very sought after so i have no idea on this this is this is manly looking to me ten dollars and it'll come with the cute little gift bag little um dust bag coach key ten dollars i gotta write it now sorry y'all okay and as predicted we have some socks these are alpaca these are alpaca 100 percent alpaca wool um, US nine through 11 and a half. They're a heathered gray. I've never heard of this brand. So brand new on the card. If anyone is interested, we'll do $8 for the alpaca socks. One of the reasons I like these fun box, because you get things like this, and as a reseller, um, you know, you get items that you can send to your customers as a free gift, or, 
you know, you can keep in your back stash when you need a little gift or something or whatever, whatever. I just love the fun box. The fun box is, to me, is so much fun. I'm supposed to get 10 items. I haven't said that, and I guess I need to, one, two, three, one, two, three, and this makes four. We'll count at the end, um, but again, I'm going to say eight bucks for the alpaca socks. They feel good, y'all. They feel really, really nice. What do we have here? We have an aloe, A-L-O, ma Magic Multi Balm, new in the package. I don't know. I guess this is like a lip balm. It looks brand new. What does it say? It says Magic Multi Balm. Clean Beauty, I don't know y'all if you're familiar with this brand. I'm not familiar with this brand. I have no idea um, what this would go for, so I'm just gonna say $5. $5 for the Aloe Lip Balm. New in the box. Okay, oh. We have some more socks, y'all. We have some grippy yoga bar socks. All grip, no slip. Increase balance and stability. Two pack, one size fits most. Giam, G-A-I-A-M. I don't know how to say it. Giam. Uh, and these came from TJ Maxx. And they were $7 for two pair. So I'm going to say four. Four dollars for these socks new on the card two pair of and they have the grippies the no slips um and of course you don't have to use these for yoga you can use these for whatever <laughs> they're a green and a gray green the ones on back here are gray they have these cute little um you can see the model has them on like that those are cute those are cute so four dollars for the yoga socks if no one wants these, I'll probably keep these or give these to my daughter. All right, let's, this right here is new in the package, but this looks like something from either Timu or Amazon. I'm not sure what this is. Oh, it's a dishcloth. Oh, kale no. Oh, kale no. Yeah, it's just a little, it's a little dishcloth. It's brand new. It's, it's white. It's kind of, and then it's got the kale leaf and it says, oh, kale, no. That's cute. That is stinking cute. I'll do $3, $3 on the dish towel. New in the package. Oh, what do we have here? Give y'all another peek. Look, we got something. We got something exciting right here. What is this, y'all? Look at this little charm. Oh, that's not a charm. That's the that's the manufacturer tag. I get so excited about pretty fun things. Look at this. What is this? This is a, oh, this is a travel case, and it's new. We still have the um, silica pack in here, and I'm going to put papaya, papaya. Yo, know, this thing feels like leather. This thing feels like leather. It, look at the design on it. It's really pretty. I don't know if that's leather, and it's trimmed in ribbon. Let's see what this tag says, if it says anything. Floral hanging jewelry and cosmetic case. All rights reserved, papayaart.com. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I don't know about this, y'all. I don't know. This is cute. I'm going to tie it up so you can see what it looks like with, the, with it tied. This is cute. I really like this. 
Anybody's familiar with this brand? Let me know. I'm gonna say 10 bucks on this. I just have a feeling that this is a higher end item. Um, so let's say $10 on the jewelry cosmetic travel case with this beautiful design. And it's new, so this is giftable. You could gift it to someone. Um, you could gift it to yourself. I'm all about gifting gifting myself things. <laughs> so there you go. I'm not counting y'all, so we'll just, um, what is this? Look at this big thing. This looks like a beach blanket or, um, so is this the bag? Oh, this is like a backpack. Look, this feels like towel. This feels like towel to me. And then inside is, or is it, I'll never get it folded back if it's one of these things that fold up. It is, y'all. Oh my goodness. Well, I gotta do it. I gotta, I gotta open it up. Wow, this is a beach blanket. Look at this. This thing is huge. I'm trying to show y'all the whole thing. We got this octopus on there and he's got his little cocktail going on and his umbrella. And we got all kind of little sea creature friends all around it. And y'all... This is Vera Bradley. Vera Bradley. This is nice. This is very nice. Um, I have no idea what to quote on this. I have no idea if I'm ever going to be able to fold it back and get it back in the bag like it was. Um, let's see. It's Vera Bradley. 100% cotton machine wash. Um, da, 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 da. so I have no idea on this. I may end up keeping this, but if you're interested, shoot me a message and, um, I'll work out a price. Okay. Vera Bradley question. I got to look this up. I've never seen it. I've gotten Vera Bradley beach towels in these fun box before. I've kept them for myself because I, I'm a beach girl. I go to the beach all the time. I have a girlfriend, my best friend, has a beach house. So pretty much anytime I want to go, I can go there. And when she's not, doesn't get sick of me. And then I live 30, 45 minutes from the beach, from Isle of Palms, Folly Beach, Kiowa, Seabrook, you name it. It's all right here. Sullivan's Island. Okay, so if anybody's interested in the Vera Bradley beach blanket bag, just let me know. Send me a message. All right, y'all, we got one more item, and it is new in the package. Oh, let me tell y'all, I love these thread-up boxes. They are great for shipping if you have big items. I sell a lot of home good items um, on Posh, Mercari, and eBay and Facebook Marketplace. Um, and those big boxes like that, I like to get those because I line them in foam and I wrap my item real good and they just, they're the perfect size, perfect size. So what we have here is a bag and this was probably a free gift with purchase. It's L Space. I'm not sure if y'all are familiar with L Space. I believe they make bathing suits that are very expensive retail. <clears throat> Um, I've sold a few resell and, and they were used and they went for pretty good too. So, but that was probably two years ago. I don't, you don't normally find those in the wild or I don't. The L Space, I think that's the brand I'm thinking of. But anyway, this looks like a beach tote. Um, they knew exactly what to send me, didn't they? Mechanicsburg always, I, I just always does good. Oh, this is like a, um... This is kind of like a cooler bag. This is definitely what this is. Micro, it's still got the dry 
pack in there. Let's zip her up. She is a light orange corally color with these striped handles. We have a pocket in the front. It says L Space. It's <clears throat> Coastal Cooler Bag. It is the L Space Coastal Cooler Bag. And I'll ask $10 for this as well. If you are interested, let me know. L Space, L Star Space, or whatever. <clears throat> $10 for the cooler bag. So what y'all think about this fun box? I think this was a great fun box. Um, all of these items are usable. I've gotten some stuff that I just, I still have stowed away and I'm like, I don't know what I'm gonna do with this stuff. Um, <laughs> a lot of it, sometimes I'll just get a whole pile and donate it to my local church thrift store. Excuse me. So let's recount. We have one the cooler bag, we have two, the Vera Bradley blanket, blanket, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. We got exactly 10 items in this one. The last couple of ones I've gotten extra, so, but I, I feel like I got some substantial items with these alpaca socks. This Vera Bradley blanket. It's not a towel. It's a blanket. It's huge. And then this, I feel like, is very nice. Um, so, let me know what y'all thought of the fun box. Let me know what y'all thought of this video. I try not to be long. I don't like watching long videos myself. Um... I just lose interest after a while, even though I might be, li I like what I'm seeing and I like the person. Just after about 30, 40 minutes, it's like, okay, I got, I need to do something. I need to clean house or whatever. <laughs> I need to be reselling. Um, Y'all have a great day. Again, emails below. Let me know if you want something. And it's going to be a first come, first serve basis, as always. The first to email me and the first to pay be yours. I ship out usually the same or next day. <clears throat> Sorry. Y'all have a great one. Bye.